My name is Migdalia Burgos and I'm from Miami, Florida and I consider myself a conservative independent. I have tended to vote early, usually in person. This last one I didn't. Uh, actually, I just drove up and I put my ballot in the ballot box because my mother at the time was ill, so I couldn't spend too much time away from the home. So it was super convenient to be able to vote either you know, by mail or by going over and just dropping the ballot in while she was at the doctor's office. The funny thing about COVID, if there's anything we can say is funny, is that, you know, we were all worried about how voting was going to go. And I have to say that Florida, maybe because it's had a long history of practicing how to do remote voting, it's always been very simple to vote here in Florida, at least I've found, compared to other places. I, I was kind of happy and surprised that in spite of COVID, everything worked as if COVID didn't exist. You know, they just were so efficient. So in Florida, where we had not only incredibly efficient uh, systems, but we had, you know, systems run with integrity and following the law and being mindful of how things are going to go and how things have been in the past. Florida has always been very efficient, very good at voting. Um, it was weird to see people like Governor DeSantis, who before the elections was saying, we're safe, we're good, we're solid, we know how to do this stuff, Florida has a history of this, to see him turn around, you know, as governor of Florida, after having promoted our systems and methods, and say, you know, I'm Governor DeSantis, and I'm going to say that our system is, is not working, is just bizarre. It's also, quite frankly, to be blunt, lying. For him to turn around and say, oh, we're just awful, is crazy. And clearly misrepresenting our, our state. And that offends me as a voter. What bothers me about these lies is not only does it make people question how our systems work, but it makes people not want to work in the system. This is how you kill a democracy.